What is up guys, Joe here back with another video and today we're checking out Apple's latest beta release of iOS 11, also known as beta 3. Now this time around in iOS 11 beta 3, we don't have much that is new, but rather some speed improvements and more bug fixes. So this video is going to be pretty quick, starting off with the notification center. So with iOS 11 beta 1, to view all your notifications, you would first need to swipe down from the top and then swipe up to view every notification that you have. And now by simply swiping down to get to your notification center, it now displays all of your notifications, which is one last step to view all your notifications from previous days. Now when it comes to the control center, there has been some bug fixes, and one of those fixes is the music widget. So normally on the music widget in previous iOS, like iOS 10, you were able to simply click on the album artwork or on the now playing sheet. But ever since iOS 11 beta one, that didn't seem to be the case. But now with beta three on iOS 11, when you tap on the music widget, it it will actually take you directly to the app that's currently playing. This is very useful because now you don't have to hunt through the application that's currently playing your audio or music. Now also speaking about the control center, when you do 3D touch on an icon, it now displays icons on the left side for some of the applications, such as the camera, notes, and other apps. Now when you're using Apple Maps, there's a new feature that will allow you to double tap and then drag your finger up or down to zoom in and out, which is pretty cool. Now I did notice in the settings when you go to your iCloud account, you now have messages able to be uploaded to your iCloud account because in iOS 11, you can now sync all your messages to iCloud and then have your messages on all of your iOS devices. So if you delete a message on one device, it'll delete across all devices that are logged into your iCloud account. Now when closing out applications on iOS 11, on beta 2, it seemed to be pretty buggy and sometimes it wouldn't even close out that app. Thankfully in beta 3, that has been fixed. So now when you swipe up to close out an app, it actually works. Now speaking about swiping up to close out apps, if you are an iPad user on iOS 11 beta 3, when you open up the app switcher, you will now be able to simply swipe up to close out apps instead of holding down and then hitting the little X on the corner. That was for sure a hassle, so I'm glad they fixed that in beta 3. But other than that, that's pretty much what is new or what has been fixed in iOS 11 beta 3. Now if you do want to install it, I'll leave a link down below in the description so you can easily install the developer betas, but there also is a public beta that they should be updating here in the next few days, hopefully. Now if you're not aware of how to install the public beta, let me know in the comments below if you want me to make a quick video for that, it's pretty simple. But if you are running the developer beta for iOS 11, let me know in the comments below what you found that's new or anything else that you found, whether it be a bug fix or anything like that. But anyways, guys, that's going to wrap it up for this video. As always, let me know by hitting that like button if you did enjoy this video, as it not only shows me that you enjoyed the video, but it also supports the channel. And if you're not following me yet on social media like Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, or Snapchat, I'll leave those down below in the description. That way you can stay up to date with what is going on and when the new beta is released and things like that or when my new video drops. Now speaking about videos, if you're not yet subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. That way you'll know when I drop my next video and also be sure to hit that little bell. That way you get a notification when I do drop that video. All right guys, thanks a lot for watching. Appreciate your support very much and uh, I'll catch you all on the next one. All right, peace.